The new Fortnite season is here and I'm going to be showing you guys everything that you might have missed. For example, did you know that the raw emote, which hasn't been out for over 1000 days, is actually going to make a return? We know this because they actually added it to a dino locker bundle, which I did make a concept of in one of my videos. But that isn't it. There's actually a secret emote, which I'm going to be showing you guys. But first, we're going to have a quick look at the battle pass. We know about this paradigm skin. Yo, let me claim these V-Bucks real quick. Free V-Bucks, you know what I'm saying? We can't complain about that. We have this skin right here. Another style of the paradigm. This emote, which I think it could be built in. Oh, actually, yes, it is built in. It says it right there. Then we just have a slurp music pack. An animated emoticon right here. The Grizz skin. Like, what is that, bro? On page 5, you do get a nice new slurp wrap. And also the laser-focused emote, which, as you can see, is just kind of going crazy looking at the laser. Wait, why is the Renegade Raider twerking? Yo, this emote's kind of sus. I'm not going to lie. Like, what's going on with this emote? For page 6, we do have this emote right here, but it is built in again. We have the Lennox Rose skin, if you like that kind of stuff. The Paradigm Moon Base style. This is actually really clean. I do like that one a lot. Then we have another emote which isn't built in. OMG, I love it. I mean... Guys, if I see any of you using this emote in Party Royale, we're going to have words, right? We're going to have questions going on. But I don't really know. This emote is like, I don't know. It's whatever. It's whatever. Then we have the Call It Bad Look music pack, which is actually really nice. The twin skin. Then we have Meow Schools right here going crazy with it. And the twin skin also has a built-in emote, which turns into this style right here. The Electro Tech Wrap. That is actually kind of clean. Then we have the Ocean Paradigm skin. That is super clean. That's probably my favorite skin of the entire Battle Pass, to be honest. I really like the colors of this style. And yeah, that's, that's super nice. And for page 10, we have got Spider Gwen. That's actually kind of clean. I like that. We have this. Wait, what? Is that a bat bling? It looks kind of bad. Like, what, what's going on with this bat bling? I don't know about that. The banner is actually really nice. Then we have the acrobatics emote, which, yes, this isn't built in. So you can use it with any skin. Super nice emote right there. A loading screen, a spray, and that is it for page 10. But then for bonus rewards, we do have another style of paradigm. Again, super nice. The hex wrap, which is okay. Uh, the Zenon style for twin. Another Grizz style right here. And what is this emote? We have an Icon Series emote. Dirt Bike Challenge. Yo. That's actually okay. That's that's a decent emote. I don't know if it's traversal or not. But that's kind of cool. I, li I like this emote. Let me have some more styles right here for the skins. The Spider Gwen without the mask on. And some more bonus rewards which haven't been unlocked. And of course we are getting the Herald skin. Which I actually kind of like this. I think that looks really nice. A spray, a bat bling, and a pickaxe too, which is kind of clean. So the battle pass isn't too bad. It's definitely got a couple of good items in it. My favorite is definitely the Paradigm Ocean style. It's super clean. But now, guys, for the secret emote not many people know about is actually follow the butterfly right here. This emote was updated before the new season, but it hasn't came to the item shop and it's clearly not in the battle pass. Now, a lot of leakers on Twitter were saying that if you completed your vibing quest at the end of last season, you could possibly receive this emote as a secret reward. And it kind of makes sense because they did release this picture right here of Sid following the butterfly. And the vibing quests also had some kind of zero point screen as well. So follow the butterfly is definitely part of the storyline. So who completed their vibing quests? Let me know in the comments because if you did, you could possibly be getting the emo. However, we don't know if we are. It's not confirmed. But if we do get the secret emo, it's going to be rare because there was nine pages of vibing quests and not everybody completed them. And also these are all of the bundles which they added to the game files. We have the Rapscallion bundle, the Cypher PK bundle, this bundle right here which includes the uh, racing skins and I think the male one right there is actually pretty rare. Then we have a power cord bundle, the new starter pack which we saw leaked earlier, the whiplash bundle and also the cuddle team leader kind of bundle. But the main two is right here we have this one which is a locker bundle. I'm not sure who is it for right now but they included the bouncer emote, the snow skin which is kind of rare and then a wrap and pickaxe. And like I said earlier we are getting a dino bundle which includes the really rare 1100 day emote raw 
So there's definitely a few rare items which have been updated this season and the battle pass has some good stuff as well. Also guys, I did mention the secret emo on my Twitch stream. So if you don't want to miss out on any of that info, make sure you do follow up the Twitch link in description. But guys, we're not done there. Something I find very strange is that they actually updated the school trooper pickaxe. And this wasn't even the Halloween update, so that kind of confused me. I'm not sure why. Maybe they're planning something with a new school trooper style or, you know, ghoul trooper style. Who knows? When I get more information, I'll let you guys know. But also, we are going to be getting the Lil Cart emote very soon as part of a bundle. We don't know what the emote looks like just yet because it's not actually in the game. Nobody can use it. But yeah, it's going to be in this pack. So, you know, if you collect emotes or you want this emote, you will have to buy the pack to get it. It won't be in the item shop by itself. And another fun fact is that the Gemini skin was re-added to the game files. And the pick it up emote is actually for the Gemini. So who knows? We could be getting the pick it up emote updated and returning soon as well, which hasn't been out for a thousand days. There was just a lot of secrets within this update that most people missed because everyone's focused on the map changes and stuff like that. And that's why I made this video because I want to try and give you guys unique information that people don't talk about or realize. For a couple of exclusive items, we do have the Cypher PK emoticon that you can earn by playing the cup. And one more item is the Dark Dragon Wrap, which you can actually unlock by watching one hour of a Twitch stream, which has the drops enabled. You have until September the 23rd to unlock this wrap, and it's never going to release again. So hopefully you did enjoy this video. I tried to include unique information, and hopefully I helped you guys get a couple of exclusive items. Also, if you're buying the Battle Pass or any new skins, consider using code Ashi in the item shop to support me out. It would mean a ton. I really appreciate the support. Thank you all for watching, but I'll see you in the next one.